here we are. It's the slow study all day day. But my technique of uh, holding on to some bad daily challenges is working off. Let's turn in summoning daily challenge for some uh, pretty good XP. I guess I need space on me. Bam. 9k summoning is better than nothing. Oh, I can't forget to include the water tally from turning in Spirit Terror Birds, right? Water tallies are pretty good. So today was actually daylight savings uh, changing over, which meant that my reset time went from 7 p.m. to 6 p.m. And all the studying I've been doing today means that I min missed yet another cache. Feels bad, man. Oh, there it is. Oh, let's let's get out of here real quick. Black mask acquired. All right, horror. Let's see. Oh, is it not? Uh, is it not counted? Actually, let's uh, let's click the beast tab. Scroll to Slayer creatures and if it'll load. Let's see, cave. No cave horrors, really? Wow, that's a shame. But uh, I did my first task, and I think I've done 21 kills on this task, so not bad. Gonna make my first block on uh, Terror Dogs, because I do need to do a good bit of Simona to uh, get the Strike Worm tasks to, that I need for my Slayer Helm. And Terror Dogs are just... No, no thanks. They're 10 waiting, which is pretty high, and no chance I'm doing those. And there we go. That's why we get VIP tickets. Dagonoth task acquired. Let's go get that hatchet. Oh, I heard my uh, ring of wealth go off, and it was just a rune plate body. Feels bad. And should be right here. Let's kill him. Just hit. Yeah, there we go. Big upgrade just after the rune plate body drop. Boom. 75 mage. Let me equip that Vanquish, and, uh, oh yeah, that looks nice. Big upgrade there. A Warrior Ring. Uh, don't think I can use that for anything, but, alright. And, sadly, that's the task done. Uh, let's see. Kings. I've killed 121, so I'm, like, right at drop rate. Uh, I don't know if I want to stick it out the rest of the hour. Nah, I'm probably just gonna go see and, and wait till I end up getting another task. I guess I just gotta look on the bright side, though. Uh, I did end up getting five DK teleports, and it's gonna be back-to-back -back tasks, right? No, of course not. Greater Demons means I can go to Krill. I think I'm gonna go... try out a Krill task. Well, that idea died really quick. I don't know if that's a super rare drop that I should be recording for, but deployable herb burner. Alright, probably the only clip from today doing my Tears of Gothics just before weekly reset. Bam, got, what is that? Three summoning levels. Alright boys, let's use the token. 179 more Dagonauts. I'm feeling it this time. It's gotta happen. That's like one and a half drop rates on its own. And I've got the Ring of Wealth. Come on. And that's a pretty big Slayer level right there. Got, uh, bam, 73 unlocked Jungle Strike Worms. So, uh, hopefully those will start showing up pretty soon. But, you know, only after I get this, ah, uh, choppy boy. Hey, finally, another Warrior's Ring. At least that's something decent, right? Level 80 magic. And, uh, well on my way to... 81, which is the requirement for a pretty important quest. So loot beams have been off for the entire duration of my account. I literally just turned them back on, like, maybe 10 minutes ago, and this is what scares me. It... Well, at least it's something different than a warrior's ring, right? Eh. Eh. Oh, I'm so happy I got it. Finally. Oh, finally, man. I was starting to get worried, like, oh, okay, let's see. Kings. 
Uh, if I throw it out here, oh no, wrong, wrong, wrong thing, wrong thing. Eh, DK's 193, so not bad. Uh, I think it actually took Turret longer, which I can't imagine how he must have been feeling. But um, oh, there it is. Do I? Do I just? Yeah, I think I do. Boom. And in case y'all didn't understand why I actually cared so much about that, other than it, you know, it's a good unlock, uh, I'd like to get some of this kind of stuff done really soon. Want to get that Herbler level going. And the level should be coming up. Nah, there it is. The big 81 mage I've been looking for. And happened to get a combat level too. Uh, but that is one of a kind. That's a pretty important quest. Guess that's a bit of a milestone. I can now use my, uh, well, my crystal bow and my black salamander. Forgot to record that, but that was a uh, 50 task streak taken care of. Just got my first gargoyle task, and I don't know if I'm going to do it. Oh, that's a little bit of a milestone. 70 uh, defense. So now 70 defense, 70 ranged. Magic is way ahead. Just the uh, melee stuff to go. Oh, I've been trying to get this all day, but finally, I have it. Jungle Strike Worms. I'm going to do 90-something kills. If I don't get it, then I'm going to prefer them. We'll see what happens. And there's 69 strength, which is really important because you now have all the levels you need for Forgiveness of a Chaos Dwarf. Oh, and I can do Wall Gothic Sleeps, probably. Oh, baby. Yes! <laughs> and it didn't even beam. I just, I heard my ring of wealth shine. Someone said in chat just a moment ago, it's so weird hearing RS with sounds. Well, that's why you do it, man. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. There's some luck. I finally got some luck on the account. Alright, first trip taken care of yeah so I set myself kind of a goal uh, to not get 65 prayer while I'm there now I'm gonna end up doing Nimi Forest and stuff so my prayer is gonna get shot up anyway uh, but I started with about 30,200 to the next level and you know you're getting like four and a half XP per kill down to 27,519 uh, so I actually got pretty lucky on the hand cannons right five hand cannons and uh, I don't know about 600 kills or so um, only downside is, yeah, it's going to be a super long grind. Well, mild heart attack as I was about to start that recording, and I got a beam for the uh, last hand cannon there. Filled up my inventory into this trip, and, uh, well, in for the night, probably. Gotten in about 2,000 KC my first day, and this is all after I ended my stream today for those that were watching, so, yeah. Quite a long one. Uh, let's see, I had five hand cannons before, so that's 10, 13 hand cannons. Uh, like 1,800 hand cannon shots or something like that. Uh, wow, I'm actually like two mobs off of 74 defense as well. And I started just below 71. Like I got 71 just about when I started, so that's, that's nice. Are you shitting me right now? I... I'm just sitting here, just casually, oh my god, really? <laughs> this is not the broadcast I wanted from this place. I gotta go to my bank now and get out of combat, and <sighs> I'll show you guys if you didn't see it. Yeah, so it should be in the front tab then? Yeah, there he is. Even something that my main is missing. There's Wallace, the defense pet, so let's, uh... Let's pop him out real quick. Over here into pets, he should be the uh, the only one. Filter. Yeah, let's do the filter. Skilling pet. And there he is. Yeah, he's going to be a pure menagerie. Override. Yeah. Add to summon cycle. Ooh. That's a nifty feature right there. I'm sure I know what that, uh, that refers to. Wow. Just wow. Oh, I totally forgot earlier for the... 
one of the last clips. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to include the, a little rant that I just had, or a little uh, discussion. Uh, anyway, it is actually day 26 that I got the Wallace pet. Uh, I went to sleep after the second trip last night, around 2000 KC. So, yeah, it's actually day 26, and I started at, like, 1790? 1789? I think 1790. Anyway... Well, that's a super odd level to be picking up here, just after a hand cannon drop. And you can see the lovely Crasher. He's literally here just because of an Iron Man. Like, I I might hop, but I mean, he's actually kind of useful. Like, I can just tag, and tag, and, uh, and tag, and then he'll kill it all. So, he's kind of helping my kills an hour. The fucker. Alright, well, found a new world, uh, but I'm going to bank real quick. This is just the loot from that run. Seven more hand cannons. A uh, whole lot of hand cannon shots that time. Uh, really going to come in handy for all of these that i got to burn through. And, uh, yeah, so crashless world now. Uh, up to around, I'm going to guesstimate 3.2k KC, maybe a little bit more, 3.3k. Um, yeah, getting fairly depressing. Still not to the drop rate, though, so I'm okay. Just checking in with another inventory. Steadily losing my mind as I'm somewhere around, I don't know, 5,200 kill count? Maybe more? Uh, yeah. Another inventory full of beams that are not what I want. Holy shit. I literally just... I... I just said it. I read the chat box if I could get this damn pick. 47, then at 06, I get it. Oh. <sighs> oh my god. I'm so relieved. Now I can go do something else and never come back here until I need the second pick for the mining and smithing rework on my main. But that is a long time down the line. Huh. <sighs> and just for clarity, it was around 5200 to 5300 uh, kill count to get it so i was only a little bit over drop rate but it was really killing me on the inside like i was thinking it's already beginning to plan like if this takes me 10,000 kill count does it is it still worth it with 15,000 like i was starting to do the math and uh i'm just i'm glad i got it and to start off the next day i just picked up a smithing level level 61 and 1800 total Tuska's Wrath ability unlocked. Level 80 in Dungeoneering. That's a few unlocks, but nothing that's super relevant because I don't plan on making any of the chaotic items. Nice, anyhow. Alright, there. Like, third try. Unabridged. Give it the XP in ranged. Fine. That's some something. Um, uh, let's get the... Is it from Thok? Not sure. Alright, there's the medium. Well, easy and medium. Dungeoneering tests done. Just rub that onto Herblore. Might actually get a level. Yeah, nice. 65. So there's uh, Wild Gothic Sleeps as well, right? Nice. Uh, and now I get, well, faster floors from the Cosmics and Law on every floor. There's a nice quest taken care of. Defender of Varrock. Get uh, some pretty good XP for that. It takes like no time to do. So mining, smithing is really nice. Because that's something I've been working on. 2k agility, 15k hunter. Sure. And there's Devious Mines taken care of. A uh, decent chunk of XP. It's faster than smithing in the Artisan's Workshop even. All right, and it's the end of week four coming in. Let's go ahead and buy this monthly token. Bank that and watch the cash attack uh, steadily deplete. Anyway, I know it was kind of a slower week. Uh, not as much happened as I'd have liked. I was really hoping to get 2k total, but uh, oh well, right? Uh, that's definitely going to happen next week. And a bit of a change of plans. Uh, going to be going for invention, so... Next few days, going to be really long grinds. Only got one exam next week instead of three, so that's nice. Uh, I'll be able to devote a lot more hours to the game. And, uh, yeah, get some big gains. 
So I'll see you guys at the stream if you uh, if you do decide to show up, and uh, if not, well, thanks for showing up here. I'll see you next week. Thank you.